Hi, Shafia. Can you please tell me yeah. what is the difference between arrays and uh, collection? Arrays and collection. So yes, Manisha, arrays are, uh, it's a fixed, uh, we can store only fixed uh, data in it, but in collection, it is a dynamic, we can store the dynamic data, whereas uh, arrays can store only homogeneous data and collection can store the heterogeneous data. So the main difference is about their storage and their uh, um, like uh, heterogeneous and homogeneous thing. Like what type of okay. data? Yeah. Got it. Can you also tell me a little bit about collection framework? Uh, yes, collection is a framework. It has many interfaces and classes in it. So uh, it uh, has many properties like order of insertion, uh, like indexing, whether it follows the indexing order, like it is, uh, whether it is a dynamic and also whether it, we can perform uh, sorting on it, iteration on it. So it has many classes like list interface, uh, interfaces like list interface, then set interface and cube interface and classes are, are subclass as array list, linked list, vector, stack, and many more, they are subclass in the interfaces. So it is a uh, collection is divided into two packages, java.util.collection uh, and java.util.map. Uh, can you show me uh, how to use iterator and list of iterator practically, please? Uh, yes, Manish. Can you see my screen, Manish? Yeah, I can. I can see. You can create a new class, please. So I'll uh, do it on array list.
only uh, forward iteration is fine and manish like list of iterator have also i have to do yeah uh, i sh i told uh, can you please show uh, iterator and list of iterator yes you can also okay, see okay. show list of iterator ones okay. how to utilize it so in the list of iterator we are performing a forward iteration here the elements are picked 10 20 30 so uh, 10 20 30 11 11 and 100 Okay, so uh, next I'll do on list iterator. Yes, Manish. The iteration, forward iteration with list iterator and uh, with an iterator. And uh, um, backward in iteration. In the list of iteration, you can also do backward iteration. Okay, Manish. Yeah, yes, this is perfect. Got it. Yeah, this is perfect. Yeah, that's great. Okay. Uh, so as you know, the return type of iterator is a iterator, right? What exactly is it? Iterator? Yeah. Is it an interface or is it a class? Ah, uh, it's an class. Class. No, no. No, sorry, it's sorry. Interface. It's an inter iterator. Sorry, interface. It is a root of uh, the collection. Mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, can you also tell me uh, uh, what is method overriding? Ah uh, yes, Manish. So developing a method in a parent class in a parent class with the same name and the signature as in a child class, but with the different implementation is called method overriding. And super keyword can be used to invoke the parent class method. and this is done on the non static uh, methods uh how can i avoid this sorry how can i avoid my methods being overridden to avoid method over it, we can make static the method of static methods because we can't override the static other than this what extra additional things i can do 
just to make sure that okay. my method should not be overridden by someone yeah change uh, the parameter list in the uh, method name in my child class also in my parent class also the method will be same and okay. parameter is also going to be same implementation is different let it be and okay. both of the both the methods are non static only but i still okay. as a parent class i don't want my method to be suppressed by someone tomorrow so what okay, shall i do you have to make the class as final class as final parent or method class. as final uh if the class is made final uh, it cannot be subclass but if a method is made final it cannot be overridden and that's what you need <laughs> yes so, method to be final so we can make method as a final okay oh, yeah. that's great that's great that's great wonderful mm -hmm. knowledge uh can you tell me a few classes in java that are final in nature oh final in nature or thread thread class which class thread class yeah okay which um, which mode um scanner class scanner class <laughs> yes yeah system class system class yeah that's string one. class that's, that's, yeah yeah that's wonderful that's wonderful <clears throat> now can you also tell me in terms of mutable uh is string mutable or immutable i uh, know this manish string is immutable and we have other two string classes like string buffer and string builder those are mutable because they can change when we perform a, uh, any operations on like on it uh -huh. <coughs> so can you uh, just write any two or three lines of code just to show me the meaning of mute, immutable okay manish yeah <laughs> Yeah, I can see your string now. Oh, yes, Nish, I have also started it actively. Okay. I thought the screen is uh, continuous. No issues, no issues, no issues. Uh, yeah, I have created a string, and I have con uh, concatenating. so as you can see the operation concat is performed on the string but string still uh, remains unchanged so it is immutable got it got it. so can you also show me uh, what is mutable can you take example of string buffer and builder and show me the meaning of mutable also please yes No, no, no. Write it like that. String buffer. Uh, like uh, invoke the constructor of the string buffer. Yes.
uh, yes manish <clears throat> so i okay. had the uh, string sp with the string buffer hmm. and i have performed append operation which is appending at the end of the sp so printing it as automation testing got it got it got it that's that's perfect can you also tell me what is abstract methods please yes manish so abstract methods are the methods which have the uh, which do not have the implementation so it is present in the abstract classes and it okay. is uh, declared with a keyword abstract why the method will have no implementation sorry why the method will have no implementation oh, you're saying right to... abstract methods are those methods which has no implementation i'm only asking why why it uh, is yes, like that to uh, yeah to hide the crucial information from accessing from the uh, external externally accessing so we hide it and we keep it in the abstract methods and then we uh, override it in the extending classes you mean child classes yes child class okay 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 um uh, okay can you also tell me what is abstraction in java uh yes manish so abstraction uh, is used to achieve the inheritance by using uh, abstraction we can achieve only 0 to 100% of uh, inherit uh, sorry abstraction so here uh, while we create an abstract method we can have uh, abstract classes and concrete classes as well in the abstract uh, sorry concrete method and abstract method in, as well in the abstract class uh, to hide uh, the useful uh, the information which is important and just to display which is unimportant and uh, it makes uh, the code safety mm -hmm. okay Got and it. the keyword extend is used to create a relationship with the abstract class in a child class. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, can you also tell me uh, uh, what exactly is uh, continue keyword in Java? Continue. Continue keyword in Java. Yes. Ah, uh, yes, Manish. So continue keyword is used to skip particular iteration and then ah uh, continue the ah uh, iteration. particular uh, ex uh, iteration and continue the execution got it got it fine fine chafia that's all from my side uh, you have a good knowledge uh, i'm really impressed the knowledge that you have so okay. that's really great uh, though you are attending the classes with off camera but <laughs> the, the 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 knowledge that you have shared today i'm really surprised and very very happy that's really great yes like so. i was also looking for a platform where i can interact and i explore my knowledge as well as to get the knowledge and i'm really awaiting to get a good platform after this uh, to jump mm. and to of my yeah no, i really understand that i'm totally understand i can see that you're doing a hard effort i can see uh, uh, the knowledge that you have shown today so that's really great shafi 